Let's calculate the vent inclusive price. When we calculate the vet inclusive price, we are including the vet into the price. Therefore, they are going to give us a vet exclusive price. Now, here we have a model. You can use this in the exams. So you can, oops, well, that just happened. <laughs> so you can use this in the exams to help yourself and to simplify this entire process of calculating that and also to, conf to eliminate any confusion that you might have. So, they are telling us that we must include the VAT. So, we are going from the VAT exclusive amount to, so this arrow shows us that we are going towards the VAT inclusive amount. Now we are going to have a value that has VAT in it. And to do that, we must multiply by 1.15 now let's have a look at why we are multiplying and also why 1.15 so if we look at this pin let's look at the pin like this and we see that this is the length of the pin so this is a hundred percent of the length of the pin however if we put the cap onto it the length of this pin is going to increase. So the pin can represent the VAT exclusive amount or the original amount. And the cap is going to represent the VAT. So we have the original amount and then we add the VAT giving us the VAT inclusive amount. So VAT exclusive amount VAT inclusive amount. So we start off the simple calculation with 100% and then we add the VAT which is 15% and that gives us 115%. This 115% you are going to convert to a fraction and then convert it further into a decimal number which is 1.15. This is where the 1.15 comes from. In our calculation, when we increase values, we can either add or we can multiply. In this case, we are going to multiply. So now you use your 1.15 and you say 1750 times 1.15 and the answer that we get must be more than the value that was given to us and this is going to give us 2012 and 50 cents so we see that the value did increase from 1750 to 2250 cents and that is how you calculate the VAT inclusive amount